Yeah, guys, welcome to Answers Tutorial. So, we are going to show you today um, the radiation, radiator, and the uh, and room or in the house. So, because we are doing this, we want to be uh, aware of the thermal distribution or the pressure distribution or the velocity distribution of the uh, whole enclosure in the room. So, the most probably we are using this application to learn the, the natural convection effect or the uh, the natural gases normal uh, convection uh, movements so we we want to define the <clears throat> we want to define the the whole thermal distribution in the uh, in the enclosure that you have determined in the ANSYS so let's start so yes, as you know, we are using the fluid flow fluent. So we are creating the uh, standalone system, and after that, yeah, uh, we are beginning the geometry, as you know, and and after that, mm, we are we will create our enclosure, uh, which is mean actually the the box or the house. So the uh, the radiator we will uh, put the radiator in the house. So we are gonna uh, create the whole house or whole room or the, actually the whole enclosure and uh, uh, we are creating the um, the radiator. So so here is our design model and yes we are beginning to x y plane and we are taking the these steps. So we are creating the rectangle. Yeah. After that yes we are giving the dimensions of it yeah so it's not so important but so yes you can uh, adjust your settings of it so I'm just doing this to, to a cube yeah yeah I generated an MX studio again so I applied my geometry and after that okay maybe maybe not cube so it's the Mm, that's kind of a mm, object yeah so it's our enclosure so actually we are saying it we will uh, adjust these um, the enclosure as a as a air yes you can use mm, you can use the as a fluid or something actually yes air is a fluid but so yes you can adjust this enclosure as a mm, as a water or oil yes uh, which is your working on it so it depends on uh, what you work with so yeah we created the enclosure so after that so mm, we are creating a new plan okay so here is our new plan and yes xy plan and then we are transforming it offset z so it's about it's about a half of it so about 150 Okay, I'm generating it. So again, yes, I'm creating my, um, I'm creating my radiator in the whole house. So yes, maybe, yes, it has to be like a radiator. Actually, as you know, it's it's just a, uh, the 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 two phase actually the two two phase matter simulation. So yes, I'm extruding it as a maybe the, the 15, 15 yes yes it's not symmetric but because uh, we can we can see all the thermal distribution is not symmetric so after that yes I'm generating it again so here is the here is the bit tricky point so operation is not a material yes you have to choose that frozen because if you are at material, here is a no, just a solid one, so they are the inside of it, but they are the same part. The answers understand that. But if you are at frozen and generated, yeah, they are the separate parts now. So after that, it, it isn't uh, enough for it because so he is understand that even the our radiator is uh, in the air, and the air has the volume of uh, the radiator in. Yeah, now we have to boolean the each other. So, so our operation is subtraction. So our, as you know, uh, our target body is the big one. Yeah, right. It's the uh, room. 
is the air and the two bodies our mm, radiator yes that's it and generated so there there is again another tricky point is uh, something like the before one and the building operator is we have to preserve the two body yeah right okay because we are also we are still have two body yes we can create the names of that so we can rename it so here is our room air and we, we don't use air okay and the solid one is radiator right okay here is a room and radiator that's okay so yeah we are generated it after that if you want to do the yeah like this yes we are creating the walls actually yeah here is the radiator point as you know okay here is the, our uh, convection surfaces as you know okay yes and the right click and the none selection so here is our uh, convection wall so it's it's gonna be convected the heat so by these walls so convection wall yeah and generated it so everything is okay for the design modeler so yes let's go to the our mesh mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yes as we know uh, the creating the generating the um, whole mesh actually uh, is the tricky point so you have to adjust for yourself I am not uh, explain deeply of this situation so <clears throat> we are just mm, doing our mesh uh, enough yes you use enough mesh for us for this tutorial but uh, don't forget to mm, adjust your mesh uh, related to your job yeah yes we are we will generate the mesh after that so we click on at the mesh and just relevance center is medium I don't want to to hire I don't want to so run my computer so let's click on the generate mesh and it's it's generating all the uh, air and actually hold the yes we can cut this hold the radiator so yeah we did a bit false yes we are yeah so yes yeah it's generated it's generated to both of the mm, boxes yeah both the as you know room and radiator they are generated right okay so we just done the mesh update it's done and let's do the setup one so yeah here is the most important thing right so we are gonna um, use our system with solving the this simulation yeah after that mm -hmm. Francis is doing something for about uh, simulation yes yes we have to um, choose transient and we have to choose the gravity because of uh, we want to see about the convection effect of the movement the, mm, the radiation yeah movement the uh, the particles in the air so we have to uh, do these adjustments after that yes models so we are opening the energy equations and our um, fluid is related to k epsilon uh, turbulence model actually yeah yeah you can uh, select a hundred for your job as you know that's just one tutorial so yes uh, I wanna create the, the other material um, for my not for this yes this is a fluid yeah here is our mm -hmm. I wanna make this is copper or yes you can have gold you can select I, I will use the copper okay so you are not doing these or if you want this you can change these values but but you have to you have to copy them and after that change and create but here's a tricky point here is uh, here is no case not here okay the copper has been 